And welcome back to the action from the World Cup final at the Brayhead Arena in Glasgow. In picture, Olympic champion, Yulia Barsakova. Onto the fourth hand apparatus for rhythmic gymnastics. There are actually five. Rope, hoop, ball, ribbon and clubs, but the clubs takes a miss this time. This the last of the four finals in this World Cup final for rhythmic gymnastics. We saw Alina Kabaeva take the rope and the ball gold medal, and this young lady, Yulia Basukova, take the hoop gold medal. And now the ribbons is up for grabs. I must say, an intriguing outfit. And I hear that Andrea Raducan likes them too and wishes that the artistic gymnasts could wear jazzy outfits. Rubik gymnasts, of course, extremely theatrical and sometimes just a little bit over the top, I think. But um, that's a matter of opinion. But that elegant, and as you can see, it's not in fact a two-piece, it is a one-piece, but uh, a netting around the midriff, showing off her Slender line. Now the judging is uh, appears quite complicated. We have technical marks of five, artistic marks of five, and execution marks of ten. And all of the scores are added and then divided by two, which brings the gymnast's final score on each discipline. That is in rhythmic, of course. They're launching the ribbon into the air, catching by the handle after the beautiful split leap. And they're bouncing the handle and hauling in the ribbon from its tail. Very clever maneuverability of the hand apparatus. Beautiful work there. Julia surprisingly took the gold medal in Sydney. She wasn't expected to. Kabaeva was expected to, but an un unforeseen error caused the very reliable and consistent Basakova to jump into that gold medal position. <laughs> 